www.tcmshop.com or call 888-9-TCM-SHOP. I'm Robert Osborne. Thanks so much for being with us. Since earlier this afternoon, we've changed our previously scheduled Sunday with a day of films dedicated to Shirley Temple, who died on February 10th at the age of 85. She was indeed an icon of all the famous child actors to grace movie screens. Shirley was the most famous and most revered. At the age of six, the most famous person in the world, as a matter of fact. Remarkably, that early fame didn't seem to have any negative aspects on her as she later grew up. Throughout her life, she remained a very down-to-earth, extraordinary person. She retired from acting in the mid-60s and switched gears altogether, embarking on a career in politics, serving as an ambassador to Ghana and Czechoslovakia. She truly lived a full life, and what a pleasure it is to be able to salute her at this time with some of the delightful movies she made. Well, our next movie is called Bright Eyes, released by the Fox Studio in 1934, before that studio merged with Daryl F. Zanuck's company called 20th Century, and thus became 20th Century Fox. Shirley was six at the time. She'd already appeared in five feature films, but this movie, Bright Eyes, is the first one in which Shirley received top billing, solo, and it's also the first one which had actually been created for her. Those earlier films had proven how adorable and how talented she was, but this next one was the real beginning of the Shirley Temple legend that endures today. Soon after Bright Eyes, she became not only the biggest box office draw in the entire movie business, but the most famous female in the world, all before she was seven years old. Bright Eyes was filmed very quickly, in just three weeks, so it could be in theaters by Christmas of 1934, which also made it a first in a long line of Shirley's films that came out either at Christmas or Easter. It's also the film in which Shirley sings the song she's most associated with on the good ship Lollipop. So here with the cast, it also includes Jane Withers in her first important movie role, playing sort of the auntie Shirley, a bratty little monster he'll want to send to the moon. Also in the movie, the wonderful Jane Darwell and James Dunn. So from 1934, directed by David Butler, Shirley Temple at age six in Bright Eyes. Mm -hmm. 